Welcome back fellow coders, Jared O'Leary here with Boot Up. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make it look like the bowl is filling up when it catches a food sprite. So what I wanna do is uh, inside of the food sprite, where it's got the if touching bowl, I'm gonna go ahead and create a message that I've called fill the bowl. So we're gonna send this over to our bowl sprite. And when the bowl sprite receives this message, fill the bowl, the code that I'm going to use is going to make it look like it's filling up. So I'm going to go ahead and make it change the size. And I'm going to do that by 20. And then I want to change the fish eye, um, or rather set the fish eye to something like 50. Fish eye will make it get uh, like it's uh, filled. So it kind of gives it a bulge to it. And then I'm going to wait a little bit before I reset back to the original size. So I'm gonna go ahead and change the size by minus 20 and I'll clear the graphic effect. So this code will make it so that it does that. So now when I run the code and I catch the food sprite, it makes it so that it looks like the bowl has filled up. Now, if um, I were to stop this while it's in the middle of being filled, and then start it again, it would start with the fish eye and it would start with the larger size. So I need to make sure that I go into my setup right here and I actually uh, reset to the original size, like 100%, and I clear the graphic effects on my setup. So just in case somebody stops it right when you catch it, when you restart it again, it won't be with the fish eye um, and it won't be a larger size. Cool? So in your food sprite, add in a message, something like fill the bowl, then in your bowl sprite, make it use some looks box, maybe some motion box to change the way that the bowl looks and just reset it at the very beginning when it does our setup code. Hey everyone, if you're watching this on YouTube, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. If you're not watching us on YouTube, you can find us on that platform as well as other social media outlets by searching for Boot Up PD. And if you're looking for more free lessons, projects, and resources for teachers and students, visit us at bootuppd.org, where you can also learn about our high-quality professional development.